Hello again, this is Priscilla Batzel in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Fluid Art Studio Gallery in the mood for to use some prism pores, primary elements, in this case some Chantilly lace. And I'm wondering if I should spread it across, but what I think I'm going to do instead is add some frosted berry to it. Some true silver. Blow those chips out of the way. I've got a new batch of jasmine prison, uh, primary element. I've been craving to do some stuff with orange. This is sour lemon. With a little bit of orange crush in it. This is saffron, a prism pour. So is this. So is the sour lemon. This is the orange crush. I've got some pink diamond. Another prism pour. And my new favorite fluorescent red violet, Vivid Intense. Gonna need a dish. I think I'm gonna use some uh, some Mayan gold. I have a fresh batch of Amsterdam black in Australian Floetrol and I think I'm going to give myself a little bit more Chantilly lace. I'm not sure why. I just want to make sure I have enough paint to go to the edge and I'm going to make sure that by adding some am I? <laughs> some mead and black which usually covers really well. And I'm wondering if I should have to use my spatula on it, but since I have it here handy, I'm going to do that. It feels like there's something on my spatula or on the canvas though. This has to be quick don't have a lot of time. I'm being naughty <laughs> by even trying to make a painting right now. It's late in the day where I am and it's almost dinner time. Make sure my edges are covered. Not all the way down, but at least at the top edge. Not sure why. I'm going to throw that in the bucket. Although, I could use a clean one of those. And something to put cell activator in. And I think I'll do that. Oh, you know what? I forgot a color. I have some Chantilly lace. And some ultramarine blue from the Vivid Intenses. I gotta remember to cover that. Throw that in the bucket. I'm not sure where I put my lid, but I bet I have an idea. Excuse me for a moment. All right, so I don't usually use my spatula, but I'm going to do it this time. And then I'll use a card if I want to. I'm gonna wipe off my spatula on the edge. Looks like something I've done already. 
that's okay because I probably liked it as much as I like this, which I do like this that much. I do need my scrape dish though. That was interesting. I don't usually do that, but I'm glad I did. Scrape off my excess. Go back for a little more. What am I going to do with that? Put it on the edge. I have a little bit of space. I could use that color. Scrape off my residuals. I think I'm just going to do this. Scraping off my residuals. Fill in my little gaps. I could probably put a couple of um, spirals in. Let's just try it on the blade of the spatula. Scrape off my residuals again. I think I'm going to succumb to the use of a playing card for my last few. Now one of the things I like is negative space or surprise textures. And I've got surprise textures and negative space. What am I going to do? Something unexpected. Make it into a geometric. Just add some unexpected marks. Take my dripping residuals, put them in the little holes, the gaps. I'm going to grab a skewer. Maybe I'll just use the... Yeah, I've got a painty skewer. Just circle around. Put a few little spirals in right where those gaps are. And use a torch. I kind of like that. That's fun. <laughs> I kind of want to do more, but I don't think I need to. That's okay. It never stopped me before. All right, that's it. And uh, I'm not unhappy with that at all. I'm going to clean up for dinner and don't call me late. <laughs> I'm going to shimmer this at you. And it's going to, oh, I love those colors. Woohoo! Those are awesome. Thank you for joining me. I post at 10.15 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm not sure which is the best way up. I like a bunch of them. Sometimes I just want to blow into things. Because I can't, can is the name of my first book on the Amazon link. Below show more. Near the uh, color art coupon code that slides between 20 and 30 percent depending on what you're spending at the time. I love you guys. I hope you come again. Play. Thank you for the thumbs up and thank you for sharing my videos. Thank you for your kind words and your comments that keep my morale boosted. Um, my email address is EASPB and the word gallery spelled out at gmail.com if you'd like to contact me regarding purchasing an artwork or uh, more information about taking a private one-on-one -on -one class with me. I'm happy to help you out on my link tree near the coupon code for color art and the other coupon code for pixel paint design where you can get Australian Floetrol Boom Gel and Pebeo paints and more things. Um, the link tree has Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links, a couple of my websites. I'm trying to figure out which one to keep and which one to let go of. Um, 
I did say I sold my artwork and give lessons at the house in Spring Hill, Florida. I'm trying to read across the room. Thank you guys for the donations through PayPal. The icon's on the bottom right-hand corner of my YouTube channel banner, and it really helps me purchase art supplies, and I appreciate it. Shopping my Amazon link is also at no added cost to you, and you can find my two books there because I can in Unlimited Possibilities. And uh, they're the first and the second hundred videos I made for YouTube. What else can I tell you guys? Oh, all my merch... All my art gets put on Teespring Clothing, now called Spring Clothing. I made a mistake. Um, Society6, Le Gallerist, um, Pixels.com, Fire in America. And you can have whatever you see added. If you haven't done it already, you can, you can request it. And it can wind up being something that probably no one else but you will have. <laughs> Although it would be nice if more than one person did. But it doesn't seem to work out that way lately. So uh, I love you guys. My paint pouring recipes below show more. If I've forgotten anything, it's that I have 30 lists, 30 playlists of videos, and um, I have all my videos organized by topic and genre too. So if you're interested in having anything, this looks great all directions. This is going on something for sure. This is a combination, geometric and whatever. <laughs> um, anyway, so my community board will show you tomorrow's video at 10.15 a.m. Questions are welcomed and encouraged. Uh, if I've forgotten anything, you'll see it in another video. I love you guys. Take care of each other. Bye for now. Priscilla out. I'll see you anon. Maybe tomorrow. Thanks for stopping by.